Hey guys, this is Jenna Bush for TheRealStanLee.com. We're here at the Hammer Museum to celebrate the new Tashin book, 75 Years of Marvel, From the Golden Age to the Silver Screen. We're going to be chatting with Stan Lee, Roy Thomas, and Kevin Smith. What about this book is going to surprise everyone? The price and the weight. I mean, first of all, you have to be in good condition to buy it so that you can carry it home. So tell me a little bit about your favorite parts of the book. Uh, so far, I'm liking the print style. I like the fact that it's pretty big. I mean, it's something that you, it's a must have for collectors, which is what I am. So I kind of needed to get it. This must have been a huge walk down memory lane doing this book. Um, and I'm curious, was there anything outside of your well-documented career that surprised you or that you've forgotten about? My memory uh, about the, the, my time in comics and my relationship with Stan in particular were always so strong that I didn't have to remember too much more. They, they've always been with me because it was, you know, one of the most important things in my life. The first thing for us is just the exhaustive research and as well to sort of try and bring to the table a lot of the stuff from sort of pop culture that was inspired by Marvel Comics and and to see how that all could tie in. Okay, so I know you've had a ton of comic book properties in your hands at one point or another. Is there <laughs> is there a particular property of Marvel's that maybe is lesser known that you'd like to do in movie form or TV? I mean, one of my favorite Marvel properties of all time I got to work on, I, I wrote Daredevil for a while, uh, but Joe Quesada was, was drawing. Um, that was something they made a movie of. When they made the movie, even then we were like, I can't believe they're making a Daredevil movie. And I like that movie quite a bit. Now they're making a series on Netflix and a television series treating Daredevil like seriously. That's, you know, that, the moment I heard that, and there was others, you know, they're doing street level, all Marvel street level defenders, if you will. But I rolled this here, man, because I was like, we're in a world where people consider this so seriously now that they're willing to bank millions, not just on a one time, like, let's hope it works movie, but they're like, let's go, ongoing. It's legitimate enough to continue telling an episodic serial story. Thanks for joining us on TheRealStanLee.com. I'm Jenna Bush. I'd say Excelsior, but that's Stan's line. Stand a little straighter, walk a little prouder, be an innovator, we will show you how to. We belong, we belong, we belong, we belong to the Merry Marble Marching Society. March along, march along, march along, march along to the Merry Marble Marching Society.